the timing of this just three days before the elections obviously if they have not done it for five years and they're doing it today it's because they have a view that this is going to further polarize well there are three main issues why we totally oppose this the cpim totally opposes it the first is the act itself we had opposed it because it changes the definition of citizenship in india and links it to religion which is highly discriminatory secondly we oppose it because the timing of this, just three days before the elections, the, uh, the announcement of the elections means what? Obviously, if they have not done it for five years and they're doing it today, it's because they have a view that this is going to further polarize, which is what the BJP thrives on. Polarization and division is the DNA of the BJP's politics. And that is why they have chosen this time. And the third is the rules themselves are intrinsically against the constitutional federal character because the state government has absolutely no role to play. This is absolutely shocking. They have given responsibility to the postal services. They have given responsibility to the railways, but not to the state government. And only two invitees from the state government will be part of the panel to decide citizenship. It's absolutely objectionable. So on all these three counts, the CPIM opposes this.